there we go. Okay, uh, just before we start, have you got any um, food or um, yeah, yeah. any water? Have you got plenty of food and water? Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so just before we continue, uh, just letting mm -hmm. you know this is recorded. Um, yeah. just, so, just so you are aware of it, and um, we'll be taking note of everything, just to make okay. sure. Um, so, first of all, I'm going to go through the Twitter posts we have. Mm -hmm. um, we've seen, uh, let me just get them up right here. So, it's a picture of, are you able to name the officer? Uh, Grant Tad, I can't remember his last name, I think it's Andrews. Grant Andrews, okay. And it's, you typed, are you, um, Put on on Twitter. This officer called me a prostitute. Bro. Yes. I put one okay. seventy six to the latest fight. I'm about um, uh, two mics out. Um. So, what was actually said? What did he say to you? He basically, for for no particular reason, he tried he tried asking what I was got arrested for last night. Okay. And then basically, he just started searching back on like obviously convictions and that. For no particular reason, then he started saying, Oh, you need to update your mugshot on here in case you look like someone that's off the street. Yes. Belongs on a corner. And I was like, What are you basically trying to find across the street? And the like, yeah. Right, okay. So, so do you have any particular reason why? Did you ask him to look for your records or no, anything I didn't like that? At all. Literally just said, what, what were you arrested for last night? I saw you in the cell. And that's when he started looking back on my records, reading everything out. Right, okay. And what was his reasons for being there in the first place? Was he responding he to something or...? No, he needed his vehicle fixing. Right, okay. And you were able to fix his vehicle, correct? Yeah. Okay. Um, so, um, prior to that, so did you say anything to him afterwards or...? So yeah, did you say no. anything to him afterwards, sorry? No, I didn't say anything to him else afterwards. He literally just started driving off after I said, basically, oh, you call me a prostitute. And then that's when I thought he that. And he drove off. Because okay. I had other customers as well. Sorry, if you don't mind me asking. So yeah. you said that, um, so obviously he said, so did he allude to the fact that your, your current mug shot, um, and uh, your words are, looks like someone that belongs on a corner. Is that, is that yes. what he said? Yes. In relation to your current mugshot. Yeah. And then you asked if he if he was trying to call you a prostitute and what did he say in response? He practically said yeah. Do you know exactly what he did say? He he practically just said, Yeah, that's what I'm calling you. Like, I'm trying to figure out the words that he put it in. I think it was if you want to call it that. Because even I know Jamie outside, he even asked if he, he was trying to call me a prostitute and he said that's if you want to call it that. Oh, that's okay. Now, have you had any um, incidents with this officer before? Yes. Um, basically, he came into his head at one time. I can't remember when it was. It was like weeks ago now. But he practically turned around and said, do you want to buy any weed off me? And I was like, no, you're an officer. Why are you asking me that? So then straight away what I'd done is I'd done a 911 and I called in saying that I, obviously I just had an officer there asking me if I wanted to buy weed off them. But I don't know if anything progressed off that. All right, do you Did remember what... that incident to Yeah. I don't think it's been a while works here, I don't think, I don't think. Um, I think, I think it was him. Right, and what did he say to you, um, in response to it? The officer? What, the officer that reported it to him? Yeah. He just said that doesn't seem right, um, was there any, like, was he drunk or was he drunk? But I said, I don't know whether he was drunk or not. Which is, like, obviously, why would an officer turn around and say that if they were drunk? Oh, right, okay. 
And where was the location where he where he said at this Benny's. to you? It was at Benny's also. Yeah. Okay. So, um, do you have any other questions, Quag? Um, no, I'm just going to go over what I've written down here and you just tell me if you believe it to be accurate, alright? Yeah. Um, so, he went to the mechanic shop to do a bit of repairing. Um, he asked you why you were arrested the day before and then he started going through your priors and reading them out loud. Yeah. Was there anyone else in the mechanic shop at the time when he was reading your charges out Jamie loud? Jamie outside. It was Jamie. Okay. Uh, is he also Bob, a mechanic? No, he's not. He was friends, like, basically, he came with me in my car so I could get my car fixed. And then, obviously, that's when Tristan started coming in. Um, I know Bob was in there, but he was up at the office, so he wouldn't have been able to hear it. <laughs> okay, and did you give... Um, but it, were you asking Grant at all, kind of, like, about your priors or anything? Like, did you ask him to read it out loud, or was he just doing that off his own accord? He was just doing it off his own accord. Okay. And then you told... Um, he told you um, that you did your mugshot updating um, as, um, I quote, the one that you have now looked like someone that belongs on a corner. Yes. Um, you asked if he was trying to call you a prostitute. And from what you remember, he said, if you want to call it that, and you believe that he practically said yes. Yes. Okay. Is there anything else that you would like me to add to my notes here? That's all I can think of. Okay, I don't have any I, I, I was just quite shocked how an officer could turn around and practically call me a prostitute. Yeah, no. Um, obviously, that is not how we want our officers conducting, so we'll definitely look into this for you. Um, that's why, as soon as I saw it on Twitter, um, yeah. that's why I mentioned it, and that's why we came over um, immediately. Because yeah, yeah. so, that's not something that we condone. You. Yep, no problem whatsoever. Do you have any more questions? No, I just um, appreciate you being cooperative and yeah. letting us know. Well, as I said, these things like that, officers are there to be, uh, you know, um, yeah, yeah. you know, they're, they're there to be respectful mm -hmm. um, and well, professional. What I, was, what I was actually gonna do was I was actually gonna finish off the customer's cards and then I was actually gonna come here to report it. But then obviously I saw all of you coming in. I was like, have I brought the whole force here? Yeah, no, that's that's absolutely fine. Um, it's yeah, what yeah. should happen, you know. If yeah, if you uh, in future, well, depend on what happens. If you are able, if you have any other issues, um, yeah, with yeah. this officer, um, please just don't hesitate just to contact um, yeah, yeah, we'll you know, contact us and we'll, you know, address yeah. it um, respectfully and correctly. So, alright, thank you. Okay, no problem at all. Um, I'm just gonna speak to what's your friend's name. Jamie. Jamie. 